This is Lee from the Inquirer, and I'm with Gigabyte in Taiwan for Computex. And we're going to talk us through their new overclocking motherboard range, the 8 series. Could you talk us through some of the main features of, of the motherboards, please? Well, uh, right here I have the, this is the Gigabyte X87 OC, sorry, Z87 uh, OC motherboard, which is, if you like, our, one of our two flagship uh, overclocking boards. Over here we have the OC Force, which is a similar, uh, more, more high-end version. And as you can see right now, well, with this setup here, you can see we have lots and lots of features in this corner of the board, which are designed specifically for overclockers or for breaking records, if you like. I'll just give you a rough idea of what these do. This is an on button. This is a this is a uh, ignition button. So when we when we press this button, if you reboot the machine with this lid, you can turn on all the fans in the system without the CPU. That's quite useful for overclockers in a cold book situation when they want to raise the temperature of the CPU, for example. You can also change the gear ratio and also the frequency of the CPU just by pressing these plus and minus buttons. These little guys here are all voltage read points so that overclockers can read the individual uh, voltages that are going to the motherboard. This right here is a trigger switch so that you can lower the CPU frequency. And then once you're in the OS and you've optimized your OS and you want to hit your benchmark, you can very quickly flick that switch to go to the, the uh, target frequency. As you can see also here, we've got a the heat sink uh, supports passive as well as active and uh, water-cooled. We've got two barbs here on either side so it can be part of a water-cooled system. And if I can show you here, this is uh, what we call the OC brace. This is designed for when you have your graphics cards in an open testbed situation, not inside the chassis. These will add support to the, these quite heavy graphics cards, which can also be attached to an LN2 pot, can be lined up in anywhere up to four-way, uh, four GPU configurations. And this OC brace is here to support it. Uh, this is a unique gigabyte feature, nobody's really seen this before. And so what, what kind of users is this mainly focused towards? I mean, this is an enthusiast board for someone who wants to get the most performance from the CPU. But I guess, uh, actually it's quite a niche segment for enthusiast overclockers who really want to go for world records. Cool. And is that available in the UK now? Yeah. These boards have been available, I believe, since the NDA was lift, uh, lifted on uh, midnight on Saturday. Well, um, and how much uh, are they? Will they be reselling? This for? guy is uh, in US dollars. The OC is approximately two hundred dollars, but the OC Force uh, is will be closer to the four hundred dollar range. Cool. Uh, great, thank you very much. You're welcome. Thanks.